Hey, I got some more packages in the mail. So, why not do an unboxing video? I haven't even uploaded an unboxing video yet, but I've recorded several of them. We'll see. I don't even know what this stuff is. This comes all the way from Tucker, holy cow, I used to live in Tucker, Georgia. And this is being sent to me from Tucker, Georgia. That's pretty cool. <gasps> I know what this is. This is a python skin textured belt that I got for my guitar, Lana. I am going to dye this blue and it's going to be Lana's guitar strap. Yay, I'm so happy, so happy about that. It's so awesome. And here's the other little piece of it. I don't know how well this faux leather will dye, but we're gonna try it out and see. The next package comes to me all the way from Phoenix, Arizona, where I have cousins that live out there. So that's kind of a cool thing too. What is it? Who knows? Could be anything. I don't even remember what I ordered at this point. Oh, this is good. Okay, so my son, I, he has a new guitar. It is, and maybe you've seen me open some of the parts in another video. And it comes with a sticker, so that can go on my guitar case. Um, I ordered some Southern California style pickups. These are supposed to emulate the pickups that were in Fender guitars in the 1960s that they used in a lot of surf music. So this is a full set of pickups for his guitar and they should have that nice classic sound. He's got one of the um, retro Squires and the pickups in it are crap. So I thought I would replace it with these. These are not like super expensive pickups, but we're gonna try them out and see how they sound. Um, and maybe because it's a thinner strat, because it's the Squire, maybe we can kind of emulate some of those classic 1950s, early 60s kind of guitars. So that'll be a fun project, which maybe I will film and you guys can see how that goes. This one is coming all the way from Clifton, New Jersey. This is probably another part for his guitar, is my guess. But maybe not. Let's see, what is this? No, this is actually the die for this strap. So now I can do that project and that will be fun. And then the last package comes all the way from Caddy or Katy, Texas on Tea Tree Drive. What a neat place that is. And what is it? Oh, it's pickup covers for my son's guitar. So I ordered some silver pickup covers to go on it. And actually, I may give him my pickup covers that's on the strap that you can't really see right here. Although here's one of them. See, this one actually has the holes in it. Whereas these new ones that I ordered, these are solid. See the mirror? effect. So I might put these on my guitar right here. The only problem is this. That, there's a bit of a gap right there and I'm not really in love with that gap so much. But that's what you're going to get when you have a pickup cover like that. But that really looks cool. So I may, here let's, let's all have our opinion on here. You can let me know what you think although it won't really make a difference to me that much, but we'll see. What do you think? Should I go with the ones with the pieces or the flat one? I don't know, maybe I'll put that on my son's. We will see, we'll see which pickup it fits the best one. Actually, let me grab one of his. Th these Southern California pickups are interesting because the poles are definitely staggered in a different way than the poles that are on um, a lot of the other guitars that the pickups that I have and I don't know I'll just see which one he likes the best but I don't know that so it looks so cool I think I don't know it's a hard it's a hard call but his guitar is it, it's red with a white um, actually I'll just get it and I'll show you 
this is his guitar. It's a little bit thinner than a typical Strat because it's, I think it's because it's a Squire, but it could be because the guitars from the 60s and the 50s were thinner than their modern counterparts. So right now it's got cream pickups and these Squire pickups are garbage. So they're going away and I'm gonna put those other ones in it. And I'm just thinking, I don't know if it should be white or if it should be silver. I don't, I don't know which would look best. So, well, he's got options, so we'll see. I hope you have a great day. I'm gonna see if I can finish this guitar and maybe tan some of this leather, and I will talk to you later.